Hey, this is Jay Diana Messiah, and welcome back to Healthy People 2. Love at First Scent. Do pheromones in humans cause attraction? Well, what is human attraction? Attraction, like romantic love, works in mysterious ways. We would like to think that we know why a particular person catches our eyes, but there are a number of invisible forces at work that determine which members of the opposite sex we become interested in and which ones we don't. A number of factors come into play when we choose to become romantically involved with a person, like personality traits, interests, and values and even physical appearance but when it comes to immediate physical attraction it is really hard to narrow down why exactly are we attracted to someone scientific research has attempted to shed some light on the factors involving the selection of a sexual mate Scientists have strong ideas about one factor in human attraction. After positive test results of other species in the animal kingdom showed that bodily secretion should be added to the list of things that make us attracted to each other. For half a century, scientists have flirted with the idea that romantic attraction involves some degree of bodily secretions in humans, which are called pheromones. Though the science of pheromones has more opponents than proponents, it doesn't stop believers from indulging in replicating bodily secretions found in humans. So, what exactly are pheromones? Humans and other animals have an aromatic system designed to detect and discriminate between thousands of chemical compounds. In 1959, scientists became aware that certain insects and animals can release chemical compounds as oils or sweat, where other creatures can detect and respond to, and it allows for a form of silent chemical communication. Pheromones are generally reorganized as single or small sets of compounds that transmit signals between organisms of the same species. They are typically just one part of the larger unorganized collection of mixture of various things in scents emitted from animals. Since its discovery, scientists have found many examples of pheromonal communication, especially in species in the animal kingdom. Pheromones are classified into various groups. However, researchers have signaled out a group called signalers, which simply transmit information such as an individual's social status or health. Some species in the animal kingdom can select appropriate mates based on scent cues, deriving information in part from unique proteins associated with their genetics. Do we fall in love at first smell? There are lots of maybes surrounding the science of pheromones. Another group called a releaser, which includes three distinctive compounds, may be involved in sexual attraction. Scientists believe that a lot of our communication is influenced by these chemo signals. Scientists have had some success in demonstrating that exposure to body odor can elicit responses in other humans. Human sweat and secretions can affect the reproductive readiness of other humans. Researchers found that women could smell how symmetrical a man was by inhaling his sweat and using the information to judge his attractiveness. The research concluded that symmetry is an important factor in both men and women. Is the study of pheromones conclusive? Sweat chemical compound, which is made up of water, lactate, urea, and mineral composition of sodium, potassium, calcium, and magnesium, is not enough for science to fully embrace pheromones yet, according to research. As the hunt continues for other identifying molecules in humans that could be responsible for chemical attraction, scientists have also investigated other potential explanations for the delicate effects of smell. For instance, human babies will crawl toward the order of their mother's breasts. Baby rabbits are known to begin nursing when exposed to a specific pheromone from a lactating mother rabbit, yet, Scientists have concluded that the human infants might simply be attracted to the mother's odor print or unique personal scent.
Older prints are influenced by diet, environment, health, and genetics. Scientists also believe that they consist of far too many compounds to be described as pheromones themselves. Can men detect a fertile woman? Men can actually sense fertility on a woman. Scientists claim that this might be due in part to her pheromones. During the most fertile time in her menstrual cycle, a woman gives off a different scent which may make her more attractive to potential male suitors. There are many factors of attraction, aside from scent according to research. A woman's face may also appear more attractive to men during the most fertile point in her cycle. Also, the sound of a woman's voice plays into a man's judgment of her attractiveness. According to a recent study, a woman's voice sounds most seductive at the most fertile point in her menstrual cycle and that hearing a woman speak fertility voice can literally make a man's skin tingle. Can women assess markers of masculinity? There is a large body of evolutionary psychology research that shows women tend to prefer more masculine looking men because masculine features like broad shoulders or strong jaw lines are indicators of virility and good health. An article from the Wall Street Journal explained that from an evolutionary perspective, masculinity is basically man's way of advertising good genes, dominance, and likelihood to father healthier kids. This preference may hold truth when a woman is at the most fertile point in her cycle. One study found that women whose partners had less masculine facial features reported attraction to more masculine looking men when they were ovulating. Women whose partners had more masculine features did not report the same eye wandering. The debate over the authenticity of human pheromones has been going on for more than 50 years and it is obvious that there are many dynamics to attraction. However, chemical attraction should not be dismissed as a ruse, simply because scientists haven't yet found other scents beyond sweat and ovulating aromas that they can pinpoint as cause of attraction. However, one thing is certain, and that is scientists are on a quest to legitimize the science of pheromones. Thank you for watching this video. Submit your comments and questions in the comments area. To hear about more natural and healthy tips, please subscribe to the channel. Have a happy and healthy day.